Hello, hooligans. My name's Uncle Rusty. I'm officially reporting for video duty. We got fairy dust in the house. You guys dig her ears. It's pretty cool. <laughs> um, I don't know if you guys follow Jake Paul whatsoever, but he just released a diss track on Dana White. Yeah. Now, Dana White, it, he's notorious for underpaying his fighters, this, that, the other. They've had a beef going on. So I'm assuming that that's going to pop up in this track. Uh, but we're, we're just going to get right into it. We love puppies on this channel. If you don't know about me, you better ask about me. Please subscribe so I can quit my job. Free Uncle Rusty. Please leave Free Uncle Rusty in the comments. Let's strap up. He literally calls it Dana White Diss Track. He doesn't even try to name it anything else. <laughs> Like propane. Oh. He got straight into it, didn't he? Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. No. That was like a little preview. Yeah. Um, the events and subject matter portrayed in this song and video are fic fictitious and should not be taken as factual reporting. All public figures, celebrity depictions, likenesses, and voices are strictly intended to be impersonation and personality parody. That's this a disclaimer. <laughs> This video and song are merely an opinion and artistic interpretation. <laughs> That's the don't sue me page. <laughs> <laughs> don't sue me. I'll put it out, but don't don't sue. This UFC headquarters. 12K a fight. Now, you will be risking your life, but if you keep on winning, you could be rich like McGregor. So what about the long-term health care? Don't worry about that right now. Just sign on the dotted line, or no one's going to know who you are. He kind of looked like Dana White. Oh, well, yeah, that's the whole idea. <laughs> With I mean, the bald head and everything. There, I mean, this is obviously a parody to illustrate the pressure to not read the fine print. Look at it. Why has everybody got their arms crossed? What is this? You're supposed to look intimidating. They do all the work. We make all the money. They never ah. do We got a lot to <laughs> Yeah. Surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> Oh no, I gotta see that again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Surprise, motherfucker! What time do you treat fighters like this? You greedy bald bitch. Look at your board. Raise pay per view prices and pay fighters less? Ooh. I'm sweating like a pig. It's time to put an end to this shit, Dana. Now, everybody from the UFC. Oh, gosh. Oh, he got the eight mile thing going on. <laughs> Did you hear that? Oh, yeah. Everybody from the UFC. Oh, Hold gosh. I'm gonna end this shit, Dana. Do you see what his t-shirt said? What did it say? F Dana White. Fuck just Dana White? Yeah, just in big letters, like, <laughs> big white letters. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> First of all, Masvidal, you ain't rich. 50 fights for 5 mil, that ain't shit. Underpaid fights, where the healthcare rights? Got them risking all their lives and they can't quit. Big bags, that's the shit I came with. I like having money conversations. Hey, listen. He's got a point. I, listen, Jake Paul is very controversial, but, and I follow him, and I like him, but love him or hate him, the kid knows how to fight. We've seen him knock out how many people now? And he's still going at it, and he's doing a, a great thing for boxing. And uh, he's right. Dana White, you're a piece of shit. Straight up. Pay your fighters more. I mean, yeah, It obviously he's taking a comedic interpretation of it to produce this video. But low pay, no health care in a sport where you're guaranteed to get major injuries. Um, no. <laughs> and, and th there's been, you know, stories of manipulation to keep the fighters fighting, basically. Yeah, and he, he won't let them fight nobody else, like, uh, yeah. because they're under contract and this, that, the other. Anyways, sorry, we're talking too much. Let's get into it. All that little Stockton 
shit is cool, but that list got me thinking, do you speak a different language? All the great I slap you. Yourself, boy. All you fight is just a bunch of shelf toys. Oh. Dana, won't you let him off the leash? Let him come and make some breach. Why you try to fuck the Nelk boys? What's that about? Okay, okay, yeah. Like I love the Nelk boys. I love the Nelk boys. How did Dana White try to fuck the Nelk boys? Because I'm confused on that. I never heard anything about that. If you guys know about that, let me know in the comments. Yeah, uh, that one lost me a little bit. I mean, as far as the song goes, I totally get it. That line, though, kind of lost me. I've got no idea what that's about. Dana, won't you let him off the leash? Let him come and make some breach. Why you try to fuck the Nelk boys? Walked in on Demon Time. Dana, it's a lot I know you. You be on my dick like you don't got a weapon. Get the wow. Focus on them hookers that you try to hide. Huh. In a main back seat, you're climbing. Knock out of the year, and I'ma keep inclining. Check off other boxes. Should I try it? And he pussy out because they don't want to so keep on hiding. He said, I tried to fight a, bi a boxer. I tried to fight a boxer, but they keep on hiding. They some pussies. Didn't he fight a boxer, though? No, he fought a MMA. Ah. MMA yeah. guy. We can see how well I follow this. <laughs> she don't know nothing about this. Like, I follow all this stuff. I just I just watch it because I love my husband and sit through it with him. Fairy Dust is just here for... <laughs> I, I don't know why, but... <laughs> Look at her ears. You guys like the ears? <laughs> okay. Free Uncle Rusty! <laughs> Dana lacking infrastructure. That bald bitch should have stayed a kickbox instructor. Oops. <laughs> you retired, you just cannot recover. You bankrupt. Fertitas went and pulled you out the dumpster. Fertitas did pull him out the dumpster. Yeah, I mean, he did almost go bankrupt. The UFC almost went bankrupt and dissolved, didn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even yeah. I saw that in the news. Uh, Dana, you fucking up, bro. How do you all gas like propane? Yeah. Dana, won't you lay up all that cocaine? <laughs> First he said my fights are fixing. Now he says steroid shit. I'm really on the island eating lo mein. Chillin'. McGregor, I ain't seen you win in five years. You rich little weirdo, ugly ass veneers. Took so many losses, wound it up in VMAs. Trying to fight with MGK, no surprise. <laughs> they try to fight with MGK. I don't know. They Conor so McGregor that, tried to fight um, MGK. There might have been something about that. <laughs> I'm not sure. Oh. All right, McGregor attested. It and says attested, not arrested. McGregor attested in Miami Beach. Why is he on a Sports Illustrated page? Jake Paul doing the damn thing, man. Y'all can say what y'all want. <laughs> Even his new boat can't keep him above water. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Lamborghini boat, but your career is sinking. <laughs> really got me wondering what he is thinking. I ain't even dissing now, I'm really speaking. Wound it up in jail too many times without a liquor drinking. Fuck Dana, fuck Dana White. Fuck Dana, fuck Dana White. It ain't another problem child rapping now. You about to witness Dana tapping out. Thought this shit was funny when we started, now it's quarterback and money. I'm a homes the way I'm cashing out. They done got the prom child rapping now. You about to witness Dana tapping out. Thought this shit was funny when we started, now it's quarterback and money. I'm a homes the way I'm cashing out. <laughs> he knows how to piss people off. Hey. <laughs> Jake like, Paul's got a talent for pissing people off. Like I said, he's controversial. You remember when he stole, uh, what's, what, gotcha what's hat. his name's hat? Gotcha hat. Yeah, I remember. Uh, Floyd Mayweather. Uh, you were laughing about that for a while. Oh, my God. He even came out with a clothing line. <laughs> and it said, gotcha hat. And it, and it sold out. That's funny. Thought this shit was funny when we started. Now it's quarterback and money. I'm my homes the way I'm cashing out. Dana, pay your fighters more. Give them health care, you scumbag. I have a single nice. person who says anything good about you. I passed my drug test and you went silent. I'm keeping my foot on your neck until you tap, bitch. Stop raising your pay-per-view prices on the fans and not paying fighters more. Greedy, old, lonely, bald bitch. Woohoo. Hey, hey, that that was pretty <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty direct and straight to the point. I'll say. Um, he just made Dana White tap out. Um, Has there been any response? Hey, listen, listen. Jake Paul uh, wanted to fight with some UFC fighters. And Dana White said, no, take, it, take a drug test first. Jake Paul passed his... his yeah, he, he is accusing he, him of steroids. He passed his drug test, and now Dana White won't like get back with him. So I, I can see why there's some beef going on here. But uh, overall, Dana White... Bruh, 
You let a YouTube kid, like, come and, like, stomp you out just now. Has anyone considered that the beef might be hyping up to generate revenue for both parties? That's a good point. Only time will tell. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> Jake Paul's been known for staging beef to and, and controversy that's part of his brand. And yes. the UFC has almost gone bankrupt. They need more, so. All right, guys, that's today's video. Uh, my name's Uncle Rusty. I'm officially signing out. Uh, well, not quite yet. Please help me quit my job. Subscribe and help me quit my job. I love you guys. I love you hooligans. Each and every one of you. Until next time, guys. We're so out.